Oh, well, my name is Fox Run. So again, I'm a Fox doing this all on my phone because obviously I have none of my stuff here in Chicago. I'm back in Chicago for a bit. But um, I saw Zombies 3, which if you don't know, I made a review, I think, for each of the movie, each of the other two movies, which like it, it's honestly kind of funny because I think my taste in movies has shifted very much to the point where um, like here's the thing. This movie is cheesy. This movie is cheesy as all hell. It really is. Um, like, even, but even like, I kind of like it. I, I'm enjoying. I don't know. Like, I feel like ever since like, I don't know. I think ever since like Godzilla, King of the Monsters. Ever since I watched that movie, I realized. Or no, I think more Venom. I think more since I saw Venom, the original Venom, and I'm just like, yeah, I know. Like, it's not the greatest thing. But I had a lot of fun with it. And at least for me, that is enough to make something like for me say like, it's a good movie. It is a fun movie. If I had fun at it, it's a fun ass movie. Uh, Zombies 3. It's a fun ass movie. It, it honestly really is. It's it's really good, which like, I, again, I, I, t I talk shit about, I talked shit about this, the first movie and I probably in the second one uh, when those came out. I honestly... There's songs throughout all of them that, like, it really gets me. Like, A Girl and a Zombie is a really good one. Um, this one, like, it's funny because the last movie, when that one came out, and, you know, the whole thing is, like, you know, the main girl, like, oh, the, like, who does she belong to? Is she human or is she a werewolf? And it's like, like, and then these aliens pop up. And, like, I was like, oh, God. Like, when first off, it was like, okay. Like like is she a werewolf? And it's like no. I'm like oh god. Is it gonna be? Is it gonna be that she's a vampire? Is that how it's gonna end? And no, it ends with aliens. And this episode, this takes off after that, where aliens are happening, which also like apparently just meteorites have just been coming shooting out of the sky, which they're just like, man, that's weird. These giant ass meteors coming at us. Anyways, like, I'm like all right. And honestly, like something like this, like this movie, like. Yeah, it's cheesy. It is a cheesy movie. But, like, that's also some of the charm of it. Where, like, yeah, like, you know, classic kind of zombies. Like, those, like, 1950s style zombies movie. Horror movies. And it's kind of set... Kind of in a period like that. And the same thing with a little bit like the werewolf one, too. Um, and also, like, uh, and then like, the alien one. Like, there's some really like funny leaps in logic like when the aliens pop up in this one and they're like why are you here and the aliens go uh because we're here to do cheerleading and they're like that makes sense somehow our we got word to aliens from earth okay like what but like, it's like, all right, it's just kind of funny, just like when, they, when they're they like, they're not actually here for the cheerleading? I'm like, did, did, did you just say that? I thought you were just on for the ride. I thought you knew that way they weren't. What? <laughs> it's honestly kind of funny. But also, again, like, the, like adding with that cheesiness, like, watching um, West Side Story. That that was a movie that I I really did not care for at all, and every time they did break into song and do the dance fighting kind of thing, not like like a capoeira like doo -doo -doo, like no, it's like you know they're fighting but dancing. Um, it's because of this already being really kind of cheesy. Like whenever they start doing, I'm like okay, it's kind of dumb, but also I'm liking the music and it's kind of fun. He's like you know what, go for it. It was cool, and also there's just really there are actually some cool scenes where, like the the werewolves like all their eyes glow yellow, um when everyone backs up Zed and like you know what is it, extraordinary Zed I'm trying to remember the song because that song was stuck in my head for a minute and then a girl and a zombie played I'm like oh no no that's stuck in my head now. <laughs> I already talk more about the movie like when I get back to Texas that's gonna be like in a month so, it's eh, I don't know but. This movie was fun. This movie was honestly a blast. Like, again, if you're going into it, like, with it being, a, like, a cheesy teen movie, 
y- I think you would enjoy it. I-, I I sure as hell did. It was it was fun. The characters are funny, and it's also really funny too when like throughout the movie, Zed like will talk to the camera, and then he'll go back to talking to everyone else. Or, like, he'll talk to someone, and, like, he doesn't like the answer, and then he talks to us instead. But then, randomly, the main girl then starts talking to the camera, too. I'm like, oh, right, I, you have that power, too. I completely forgot. Not to mention, I also do kind of like, like, the, I guess it's color coordinating of, like, like zombies have green hair, pale skin. The werewolves obviously have brown, wear pelts, but then, like, have, like, that silver streak of hair. And then the aliens, they have blue hair and lighter skin. Um, Also, there's a message about global warming in there, which I'm like, all right, cool. And also, like, you know, you shouldn't be quiet to try to change the world to make it better just to make it makes people uncomfortable. I'm like, all right, I like these messages. They're not bad messages. Um, Werewolf girl gets a non-binary partner. (laughs) I'm like, hell yeah. Uh, But... Yeah, also, uh, Allison, I think that was her name. Her, <laughs> God, like, the, the the names are so, like, I, I gotta, I'm sure there's probably some other ones with the other characters, but when they said Allison's full name, I think it's, like, Allison Roswell, Ro, Rosalind Walsden, Walsden, or something like that, and I'm like, Roswell, like it's like Rosalind Wilson or something like that, and I'm just like Roswell, really. Like the alien girl, spoiler, she's alien. The alien girl's literal name is Roswell, but okay. Like, and there's a character named Alan for alien, but yeah, I'm just like, all right. Also, I do like when the aliens follow up and they do in their whole dance sequence, and they're like, we're not here to fight after their ship has been blowing shit up, and then like, mind you, it's probably like on accident. But then when, when the, the werewolves are attacking, they just start beating the shit out of them. And they go, we're not here to fight. We come in peace. Beat the shit out of all of them. Like, oh, God. Um, also, Allison just getting, like, rejected by them when, like, she can't use their magic powers. Alien magic, alien powers. Yeah, and then, and then spoilers at the very end, because it's the last movie. Like, there's, like, a little recap of, like, you know... It's it's a it's a dumb movie, but it is a fun movie. It, honestly, it literally honestly when I saw there was a Zombies three, I I texted my sister because I knew I was coming back to Chicago, and she's the one who kind of introduced me. And I watched it with her the first time. I'm like, we gotta watch this movie. I'm kind of excited. <laughs> so and I and I, I'm not disappointed. This was fun. Uh, I like Zed's uh, song because like there's a whole thing about him trying to get into college to basically be like the first song we call is that way like they can start integrating like more monsters into the colleges, which I'm like. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Like, again, they're still going with the whole segregation thing. Like, what is it? Uh, the first movie was about segregation. The second one, kind of segregation, but also was, like, about, well, some, like, lingering segregation, like, lingering a little bit of racism, but are also, like, uh, like, one of a Native American kind of thing with, like, the people come inv- people coming and taking the land, like, the people like, hey, you know, we kind of want to live on the land we used to live on, and then like, you guys kind of kicked us off of, and then... This one is about, like, you know, immigrants, alien immigrants or whatnot. So, I like the themes, honestly, that go through all these. The music's fun. The dancing's pretty good. Um, there's nothing as funny, though, as, like, when Zed bounced his back off of cement back onto his feet in the first movie. But it is, it is still pretty fun. Also, I was kind of hoping that they were going to tie, like, everything together. Like, oh, the moonstone that gives the power of werewolves actually comes from the aliens and, like... Because the Moonstone also, after the thing, has actually created the zombies too. So I was like, maybe like they're going to try to connect all of it together. But no, but I'm like, all right. But the, the movie's fun. Again, it's supposed to be cheesy. Uh, the, the character who's like the cousin, he's really funny. And like the ending bit where he like, he's just going to get on the ship and spread cheerleading to the galaxy. And I'm like, that's really funny. <laughs> Like the movies, the movie's honestly great. It's on Netflix. Go check it out. It's I think it's an or I'm sorry, it's a Disney Plus Disney Plus exclusive. And honestly, I kind of hope they make more stuff like that. I was like, and also it ends 
with like a recap of drawing, which I also I really love the animation drawing for that. It kind of reminds me of the infamous one, but uh, when they then they said that, I'm like, are they gonna do vampires at the end? And in the end, they do show vampires and mermaids, and I'm like, you gotta give me another movie now. I want to see the story potential now with vampires and, and mermaids in there. It's like, do these monsters all exist? Like, in this world, or are they specially... They, like, I'm, I'm confused on how this world kind of works a bit. But then also, like, I want to know more. Like, I don't know. It's a fun-ass movie. So many different comments below. Thanks for watching. Uh, I'd definitely say check it out. Also, the guy who plays Zed, I want to see him in more acting things. Because every time he's on screen, every time, he steals the show. He steals the show, like, from facial expressions, like... Like, like all this stuff, like, he is really damn good. I want to see him in more things, because he is very expressive, and he's, like, very, like, I think he's honestly a good actor. But tell me something in the below. Thanks for watching. Appreciate your videos. Hopefully you enjoy this. Tell me what you guys think if you've seen it, and we will. See you later. But, yeah, it's, it's honestly a fun ride.